Hello, how are you? Good morning, it's great to see you. Welcome to our math and number skills class. Guess what day it is today? Today is Wednesday, that's right. And what day was it? Yesterday. Yesterday was t -t Tuesday, that's right. And what day will it be tomorrow? Tomorrow is Thursday. That's right. And what month are we in? We're in the month of March. Wow. Let's put a comma here. Now, let's get out our calendar. Do you remember our calendar? Yeah, we're learning all about calendars this month. Look, up here on the top of the calendar, it says March, and there's the year 2021. And look, these are the days of the week. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So we said today was Wednesday. So Wednesday, and it's the 17th. Wow, super. See how that works? It's like magic. Let me circle. And now we can read our date together. Are you ready to help me read the date? Okay, here we go. Today is Wednesday, March 17th, 2021. Wow. Okay, so first of all, I want us to close our eyes, close our eyes, close our eyes, open your eyes. We're learning how to read the number words. This is one. One. Can you help me spell it? Remember, the letters have names, just like you have a name. So here we go. O-N-E. One. Two. T-W-O. Two. Three. T-H-R-E-E. -E. Three. Four. F-O-U-R. Four. Five. F-I-V-E. Five. Six. S-I-X. Six. Seven. S-E-V-E-N. Seven. Eight. E-I-G-H-T. Eight. Nine. N-I-N-E. Nine. Ten. T-E-N. Ten. Wow. Super duper duper. Now, what do I have here? It's a nickel. A nickel is worth five cents. Money, money, money in my pocket. Money, money. I know how to count it. This is our new coin that we're learning. This is Thomas Jefferson. He was the one of the presidents of the United States. And on the back is his house. And it's worth five cents. A nickel is worth five cents. Super. Now, I want you to look on the board, now look, it says five, zero, five, zero. What number should we put to continue the pattern? A five, that's right. So, here's a five. Now, when we learn to count by fives, there's something very interesting. Every other number either ends with a five or a zero. Look. Can you see this? Look here. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25. Look, five, zero, five, zero, five. Just like the pattern, five, zero, five, zero, five. What number would we need to finish the pattern? A zero. 
Okay, there you go. Super. So we're learning all about counting by fives. Let's count by fives on our number chart. Are you ready? Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. Wow, super. Now you're learning how to count by fives. You already know how to count by ones and tens, and now you're learning how to count by fives. Now, let's review our coins. What's this? A nickel. A nickel is worth five cents. It's bigger than a dime, but a dime is worth more. And it's bigger than a penny, but a penny is worth less. And what color is it? It's silver, just like the dime. Look at that. It says a dime is worth 10 cents. That's right. Okay, and a penny is worth one cent. But today we're focusing on that nickel. Nickel. A nickel's worth five cents. Money, money, money in my pocket. Okay, now, over here it says Art Projects K5, pages 99 through 100. So we're going to do two things today. We're also going to do an art project. you know why? Because there's some nickels I want you to cut. Counting nickels. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. These are worth 5 cents. Each nickel is worth 5 cents. So you can cut them out and you can practice counting them with your mother or father. Isn't that fun? And then you can put them in your piggy bank. Remember your piggy bank? We haven't used it for a while, but I hope you have it saved. All righty then. So what you need to do is get out your Art Projects K-5 book and open up to page 99. And you're going to cut out the nickels. Super duper duper, you guys are awesome. Now, up here it says number skills, pages 87 through 90. Ooh. Look here, get your number skills book out and let's open up to page 87. What do we have up here? That's right, it's a nickel. And how much is it worth? Five cents. Money, money, money in my pocket. Let's make sure to write our, our names right up here at the top of the page. Nice and neatly. And it says count and write by fives. So look what you're going to do. You're going to put five. And then here you're going to do ten. Because five plus five equals ten. Five, ten. And here, five, ten, 15, we're counting by fives. Five, 10, super. Now let's do this one. Five, 10, 15. And you can use your coins. Here it says to add zero plus six equals, you know, you got this. Now it says, listen as your teacher reads the story problem. <gasps> Look at the cute little Cubs. These are little bears that are called cubs. Okay, baby bears are called cubs. Three cubs were on a log. There's the log. Two more cubs sat down by them. There's two that sat by them. How many cubs do you see now? How many cubs are there? One, Two, three, four, five. That's right. So we're going to write number five here. 
Write the combination. How many are on the log? One, two, three. So we're going to write three, and then two more came along and sat by them. One, two equals five. Super duper. Okay, now we're going to turn to page 88. 88. Now look. Draw and color the balloons to match the number word. Remember, we were just reading those words. What does this word say? Two. That's right. Five. One. Four. Three. Six. Okay, so now you need to draw balloons. How many balloons are you going to draw here? Two. That's right. So it says draw and color the balloons. Don't forget, the number two says add. Look, it's a different way to add. Three plus two equals, you got it. What time is it? Remember, the hour hand is short and the minute hand is long. Circle the number that is more. Which one is more? More. That's a new word for us. More. Seven is more than five. Which number is more? Twenty-one is more than twelve. Super. Okay, and look at the cute teddy bear here with his balloons. Just like you just drew some nice balloons over here. <gasps> Color the bear, and you can add. Whoops, you guys are learning how to add so well. Number two says, circle the dime you need to buy the kite. Oh, that kite made me happy. Then it sailed off in the blue. Okay, here you go, remember. A dime is worth 10 cents. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. So you only need to circle nine. Write the combination. Look. Three bears, one, two, three, holding flowers. So there's three bears with flowers and one, two girl bears. So three plus two equals five. That's page 89, okay? Super, you guys are just amazing. Okay, that's our class for today. Keep up the good work and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.